Yo, what is up guys, Enforcer here, and today it has finally come out. I, for the first time, I am playing the legit Destiny disc on Xbox One, and it is going to be so sick. I played the beta, as some of you might have, and I thought it was awesome. I don't know what you guys thought about it, but it really got me excited for this beta to come out for the actual game, and it it's just awesome now that I finally have a hard disc copy. So, I really hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, I've been waiting a while for this game. And I'm glad it finally is out for good. So, let's see what we can do here. Now, if I remember correctly, he's going to find us a weapon. Let's see here. I'm going to make the audio louder, so you might not be able to hear me as well. But you'll be able to hear the game perfectly. Oh should be a little louder now. Okay, so. Here, I found a rifle. Grab it. Weapon. weapon, please. Thank you. I hope okay. you know how to use that thing. Oh, that's that. Okay. Watch for motion so on the tracker. I I haven't played it in like a month or two. Whoa, not a guy. It's a lot better than I remembered it was when the first. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me set the settings real quick. Give me a quick second. Okay, stick play out. Oh, crud. Why? Why? Okay, that was it. Okay, let's try this again. Please don't mess with us while we're trying to fix. Look controls, but oh, so much better. Okay. Now I'm going to be doing a lot of multiplayer videos, just me and my friends or friends. It depends how many guys I can get in one game or one fire scheme. But I know ahead. the number one dude I'm gonna be doing it with is Snazzy. He's he came over to my house and we hung out a bit and we played this game. This game. He just loved Let's it. See what's inside. And he fell in love with it and I got him one of my three beta codes. And he just went off once he found out Don't that touch this them. game existed. And then he immediately pre-ordered it. He went to the midnight release last night, which as I told you guys, I to go to because the fact that I was busy playing football, but he has the same stuff, he just, he can, you know, I need more sleep than he does for some reason. I get really tired, and then I get angry, and then I get in trouble because my teachers realize that, you know, they don't realize that I'm just tired and I'm being like an intentional. But, anyways, aside from that, I love how he's getting the damage from a mine that just blew up like, right next to his head. I'm definitely gonna need to start doing multiplayer stuff because this game gets harder. This is like Halo and Borderlands. I know it was made by Call of Duty, but this is like Halo and Borderlands instead of Call of Duty and Borderlands. Okay, let's see what we can do here. This game is so awesome. I mean, I remember this in the beta. I, I don't know about you guys, but I love it when people release betas, give you a little taste, but I didn't like that they, like, pulled it back. Like, Battlefield did it right when they had it to where the beta was out until the game came out. But the beta's still up and working, you just didn't, like, want to buy the game. But it was only, like, one map. It should have been the same way with this, where you just get, like, the same missions and the same crucible maps until the game comes out, and then they could put a stop to it, but... That's their choice. It's not our call, really. The fallen the imitator hold on this place, they're then the it creators. Caught. It's their choice. Just a little bit further. Goes. Let's hope there's something left out there. Okay. This was an old Cosmodrome. There's got to be something we can find. Incoming. Fallen Wait. ships. This close to the surface. Move. Whoa. Change anything? Whoa. Back up, back up. Oh, come on. Just leave me alone. 
no, 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 I'm pretty sure my friend's gonna be a hunter or a titan, but warlocks are just awesome. They sound like really medieval when I use a warlock, but I don't care. It's, this is the best class setup. I'll show you my dude after this mission is over, or next video. Ken's looking for the first. I really hope I can finish this mission before the video. Ends. Okay, you know what? That's it. Oh, you can open. Yeah, I'll do that later for the sake of time. I'm picking uh, up signs no, of an old jump ship. Could be our ticket oh, out of here. Oh no 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 no! Oh, I have to pause. My bad. Okay, so details. Select it. Oh, it by. Okay. I love the Nova Blast with this character though. It's. It's pretty cool. I think the other one is like a pistol or something. Hey, who are we sneaking up on, guys? Guys, who are we gonna take out? Hi. Oh. I guess I was your target. Let's go with that. I don't know. The vandals, as you start level up, as you start leveling up, get harder. There's a ship. Clear him out. Oh, already to the devil capital. A lot of people that I'm gonna do. Come on. Shotgun time. Boom! He's already gonna take the Oh, no, 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 no. No. Back up. Back away. Stay back. Well, the devil captain's already dead. That was so easy. My strategy, if you didn't see, was take down his shield and shot him in the face and kill his head blows off. I like that strategy. You guys should use that. I really think you like that strategy too. Oh my god. Die. Just die. Okay. Oh, you want something? Too? Come here. The last bullet? There you go. You are very welcome. Alright. Let me see if I can get us out of here. Please. That is like the best game starter ever. I mean, I love how there was always already like a mini boss or whatever you want to call that. Jump in centuries. He was pretty easy. We're he was just like a. Yeah, I'll go with mini boss. Will it fly? Because that eyeball thing in the beta that you have to take on is freaking ridiculously hard. All right, only eight and a half minutes. We are making good time over here. I love how, how much work they put into this game, how they didn't rush it, because now it's really cool. I love how they personalize it so you can, like, okay. dance and... Okay, it's not going to break orbit, and it just might get us to the city. Acts, you know, now, friends. about that it's the risk, man. They did a really good job on this game. See, that's, that's good at the top of the table. Double cap. Bringing you in. That's the five of that. Back for them when you're ready. Let's get you home. That is a hunter, from what I believe. And there have been a lot of rumors that this game is sort of like Borderlands, where it's like endless or to a point. I don't know if that's true, but if it is, that would be awesome. This game could last forever. I mean, this, I honestly. I'd probably choose this over Call of Duty games any day. Because it has a really good campaign. I love it when ga when games put more care into their campaign than their multiplayer PvP. Because a lot of people don't play PvPs. Because it's unfair that you get matched up against someone 
that's twice your skill. They always base stuff off of level in a lot of PvP games. And it needs to be based off of skill level. Because you got those guys that are just really good and very rarely play, so they're low levels and then you play them and you get slaughtered. But then you got those no lives that you sit there and play all day and aren't really that good. And they get they get paired up with those people. And then you got the other people that just work and work and work and when they play, they don't enjoy it because of the fact that they have these no life people that are kicking them around like they're little three year olds. I mean, a lot of games should be looking into that, and trying to make that a better experience for the people that very rarely play but try to. Like my dad, he's always busy, and he's actually playing Destiny right now. He's he's really in love with this game. He he, it was like love at first sight for him, and. He got the poster, even though I was the one who fully paid Welcome mine off before he even put a dollar down on it. But place the traveler can that's still okay. I see. I see you, GameStop. I get how you're working. Now, and there's this attack. next game coming up called Middle Earth. I think it's called. And this tower and is where the guardians live. If there are four different places you can pre-order it from, it's Best Buy, GameStop, Walmart, and. I don't know where the other one is. Maybe maybe Target? I don't know. But if if you order from different places, like three of the places, if you pre-order from them, you get the sword. GameStop has like this lit up sword of fire. And Walmart's the only one that's different from all the others. It's unlimited combo attacks. But I'm still going to pre-order from GameStop because GameStop is where I'm mo loyal to because there's no other play and trade game game places out there and as you guys might have known I used to get a lot of my games from Gamefly and I stopped working with them because ever since we moved to Tennessee their nearest location is in Tampa Bay Florida and it takes about two weeks just to get one game so it's ridiculous it's not worth the $17 a month but if you live in California around where I lived in LA area they have one in Santa Ana, and it's really only like two days, and then you have your next game. So it's pretty good if you live in that area, but when you live in the backwoods or, you know, and you're not in the city anymore, it's pretty difficult to get games. So this is my character. I think he looks pretty cool. This is his awesome dance. I tried doing this, and I flopped, like, badly in front of my friends, and they all laughed at me, and I cried. Checking right No, I didn't really cry, but they laughed at me. That, that part was good. Sign of the Goodbye. Elders. Okay, so as you can see, this is pretty much the end. I guess I'll get my stuff first so you guys can see what I get. And I'm just excited. There are going to be so many videos coming from this one game alone. And I'm sure you guys are going to enjoy them. I'll try and make them fun by doing it with other people, not just myself. Okay. And I'm looking forward to it. So let's see. Should I get anything? No, I'm not I've even got a level good 4 feeling. yet. I'm close to level 4. I'm still like level 3. Okay, so... Oh, equip new armor. Open. That's not it. I keep pressing that for some random reason. Okay, there we go. And another thing I realized is that when you get tired of your stuff, if you dismantle them, you get some glimmer for it, or money, or whatever. It's called glimmer, but I'm just going to call it money, or points, or... That's like your currency system in this game. So let's see, head over to the weapon shop, dude. Late shipment and again. He might have Strikes, shortages, only some excuse. Let's see. Okay, so So they all do 26 damage. One of them, one's a pistol. One's a rifle. One's a pulse rifle. One's an auto rifle. Pulse. I'm going to do a scout rifle because I'm more of a sniper person. I hope that's a sniper. Speaking of which, I'm going to start saving up for these babies because these are really good looking. And I'm so happy now that I won't stop at level 8. I'll just, I'm hoping to get to like level 50. That would be awesome. I don't know where that is, but it's coming up soon. You can dismantle all things such as guns and armor and I don't know what that is potential bonds warlock bond a warlock's bond is both a symbol and is a focus of power your ghost jury rigs this simple example Those okay teeth so that's 
interesting. That can be interesting. Okay, so there's just the ship right left. I hope you guys enjoy this video. There will definitely, and I promise you, cross my heart and hope to die, that there will be more Destiny games on the way. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time.